expensive, okay? What's up, you guys? What's up, Creamy Squad? And welcome back to the channel, guys. It is 2021. Happy New Year's, y'all. So in today's video, y'all, we're gonna be doing another luxury haul for 2021. I know I've been MIA for a minute, but you guys, your girl needed to take some time off of YouTube and social media just to, you know, rejuvenate like this thing called life in you know mental health is really important i just needed that break okay but i know i've been gone for too long i see your dms i see your messages and i appreciate y'all and i mean y'all 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 really rock with me like that but thank y'all i love you guys so much it's 2021 it's a new year i um really excited for the year all right i see a lot of great things happening for us all this new year so um yeah, I really I manifested a lot last year and this year I'm like, you know what? I'm gonna manifest more. We gotta manifest more, okay? Um, so I got a few items as Christmas gifts and I wanna share it with you guys because I know you guys always love my luxury hauls, unboxings and what have you, okay? So um, the first item I'm gonna share guys is this one i actually purchased one thing for myself in this haul which wasn't expensive okay because i told myself i needed to slow down on the luxury purchases because i have more things i want to do with money okay guys we got a lot of things for 2021 planned for 2021 so stay tuned and i have a lot of fun content i want to share with you guys it's gonna be my uh, dental journey because we're getting this tip done this year. So this is the first item I'm gonna share with you guys. It came in this a black bag. You guys already know what this is. I think I need to take a thumbnail first before I'm actually going through this things. All right, so hold on, y'all. Let me take a thumbnail and we'll be right back. Okay. All right, y'all. So now that we got the thumbnail out of the way, I'm just gonna get into this bag. So like I already said, this is from Bloomingdale's. You guys can see it's Bloomingdale's written on there. And uh, this is the name of the perfume. It's Amorch. It's Ashore Amorch. So you guys already know what it is. I'm gonna be showing you guys. So um, I love this. The good thing is you can, not, okay, this is like uh, this, uh, I registered on um, Scentbird. So this is how St. Bird uh, purchases comes, like their perfumes, their little perfumes, you wanna try perfume. I have over 20 bottles because I was on a subscription, but I had to cancel because I wasn't getting the perfumes. I, I think I like literally went through all the perfumes, so I canceled my subscription. So this one is so cute. I love that it's gold. I think it's refillable. You can refill it. It's either you pop it like so, and then you spread it. I have this already in my St. Bird's collection and um, it's very floral. I'm not really, I'm not much of a floral kind of person. I'm not a floral kind of girl. And um, uh, yeah, when I collected it from St. Bird, I actually did not like it. So, okay. I think it's refillable. All right, so this is it. It is, we can refill this and, um, you know, take it on a trip with you or if you whatever you want to do and that's how it it's so cute all right so i'm gonna show you guys the content of this bag you guys know this looks like a little bible it's actually a bible this color it's so pretty it's so cute i love the package you know it's this way all right so this is the content of the bag so i'm gonna put the bag away and um, yeah, it opens up like so. It is, you already know what time it is. I don't do luxury unboxings without a little bit of perfume. So my friends actually really know what I love. They collect perfumes for me. They know I love collecting perfumes. If you go into my bathroom, I have a whole tray of over 50 bottles of perfumes in it. That's too much. So, um, so I had this. The person gave, gifted this to me because I love this perfume. I couldn't wait to unbox it. I already opened it and tried it out. And my God, it smells amazing. It smells heavenly. Like, this is so cute. You guys know I am a perfume collector. I love collecting perfumes. And I love the way this actually opens up. It opens up like an um, LV 
by a box so it opens up like so and it has everything about the perfume anything you need to know you can screenshot that and I love the color of the packaging and the bottle so it says crimson rocks while creating this fragrance I was inspired by the crimson color of the rock rose of Al Haja I don't know if I pronounce that correctly Her Al Haja and the shade of its mountains illuminated by the last rays of the April sun Oh my god, this, this is it. I'm super excited. These are the kind of gifts I love getting. Like, this are the kind of gifts y'all should give to me. Okay. Um, this one is so, it has a lot of things to it. Like, it has a lot of meaning to it. Like, I already read that. It's a lot. I'm not going to read all of it, but I already showed you guys. You guys can screen much of that and read it for yourselves. I you see the bottle, how it looks. Uh, I think this is. I don't know if their perfumes are unisex, but I wear, you guys know I have unboxed the other one, the Amwatch, so my friend saw that I had the Amwatch, so get at me. This one, which I love the color of the bottle, is so girly, feminine, mature, pretty, beautiful, <laughs> okay, and it's Udu Perfume, and it's 100 ml. I think it, it's made in Oman and I think it's retailed for $340. So this perfume was made in September 2020. You can see it down below. I don't know if that is focused enough. You can see it down below that it is created in September 2020, my birth month. And I'm super thankful that this was gifted to me and it was made in 2020. Okay. All right, so now let's get into the bottle. Key fragrance note is rose essential, pink pepper, cinnamon bark essential, jujube honey accord, rose ultimate oak wood, cedar wood alas oil, and vediva oil. So this perfume always has oil. So I'm gonna show you the back of the bottle so you guys can see. Um, I love, love, love this bottle. I'm so in love with it. The color, the cap, like the cover is so unique. It's like a queen kind of, you know, cover up like, and I think it's magnetic. Like so, so I'm gonna spray this. I've actually tried it out and it smells amazing. It smells heavenly. If you've ever been to heaven, <laughs> because I'm heavy there, it smells like heaven, okay? Oh my god, the first note is, it smells like Dubai, Abu Dhabi, and you've been to the malls. Oh, this is amazing. Everybody should own this in their perfume collection. Like, this is gonna be my 2021 scent. It's gonna be my everyday scent if I'm going out on a date night. This is date night appropriate. It's business appropriate if you're going for a business meeting and you want to be perceived as that strong woman that woman who knows what she wants who got everything okay who is independent doesn't depend on nobody this is it in a bottle a class act okay this is class in a bottle it smells so good and it is long lasting as well if i didn't mention that I'm... oh let me just let me just since i'm going out after this video it smells so expensive you might want to get this for your girl this Valentine season or you might want to get it for yourself this Valentine. This Valentine, you don't have to wait for someone to get you a gift. You can get this for yourself this Valentine. The color is so pretty. Next item I'm going to share with you guys is this one right here. And it comes in this beautiful bag. I got this for myself. This is the only item that I collected for myself. Oh, I actually forgot the other item closet i'm gonna get it for you guys because it is the biggest item in this haul okay so i got this for myself and it is voce vita okay voce viva from valentino i got this for a friend for christmas and i tried it out i actually loved it i love the fox has a diamond of course you have you guys know the diamond rock starts valentino's um classic design so this is how the box opened up. I got this one because it was like, I think the original bottle is retailed for 140 or 120 or so. So this one was to um, uh, $160 and I got it uh, 
Christmas. I got it for Chris. I got it on Christmas for myself. The bottle is so pretty. It looks like the other one, Born in Roma. I think this is their collab with um, Lady Gaga. So I think this is what Lady Gaga smells like because this is their collab with her. So I had to have it. Uh, after getting it from my friend, I had to have it. It smells amazing. It smells girly. Um, not too floral. It's not floral. It's a sweet scent for me. Um, I'm not really good at, you know, describing scents. But um, you guys know I'm handy with perfumes. I've been wearing this up. So it smells so good. It has the logo. Um, it has the Valentino logo on it. So it has a rock start on the head. The rock star, of course, you guys know it's a classic um, Valentino um, design. The bottle is unique. It's like a diamond and it has this red on here. Of course, the name is written on red, Valentino. You can get this for Valentine for yourself or you can get this for your girl if a guy is watching. These kind of perfumes are the ones I mix with my wood scent if I want to, you know, tone it down. It smells, the first note smells so sweet. Oh, it smells so sweet and um, I like the way it just, it comes out. Uh, it smells amazing. Like, I think I can literally just layer this with this Crimson Rocks from Amwatch and it smells amazing. I actually smell so good right now. All right, so I love this one. This was your yeah, holiday packaging this is the holiday boxing packaging for dior okay and you guys know if they, they say if you adore her do her okay that's how it is okay if you adore her do her so i got this as a gift for christmas and guys it came with this um oh this is cute um paper bags I'm gonna dump that away I know you guys can't wait to see what this is as much as I do it is a t-shirt okay I don't know if the camera is gonna pick up the color the way it is but it is pink and I love it it's Christian Dior and I got it a size medium as a gift you guys I'm not big on collecting designer clothing I can do shoes bags but clothing not really my forte but this is a gift so I really appreciate it I love it it's so cute my two favorite colors in one pink and white not too white kind of like cream and it has a little bit of gray and this t-shirt costs a hand okay I, I went online and looked it up I think I saw $800 $890 or almost $900 for a t-shirt like I appreciate it I love it I can't wait to rock this up on with a jean and maybe my um, uh, fancy sandal that I got for Christmas is really gonna go well with this or get a white boot and wear it with this with a high-waisted jean and it's gonna be so cute with um, you know a white um, Gucci bag my friend gifted me for birthday. I love this. It's so cute. I can't wait to wear this out, guys. I love the quality. It's a little bit stretchy. So this is a size medium, and I love the quality. Of course, it's dear, so the quality is has to be dear. Woo! All right, y'all. So this is the item I told you was in the closet. If you adore her, do it. Dior her. If you adore her, Dior her. So it's Christian Dior. It's the puffy jacket, y'all. And um, this was a Christmas gift, y'all. And it's in a size large. And it's a reversible jacket as well. It can be wear. It can be worn both ways. I am not a collector of designer clothing, like I already said it. But this cost a hand and leg. Okay. So I'm gonna check on my phone and show you guys the price of this item all right so the jacket is retail for $5,530 with taxes basically $6,000 whoa okay whoa it has a drawstring it's Christian Dior of course it has a good um I can't really wait to rock this out y'all it's so cute but for the price I would have preferred a Chanel bag. Okay. But you know what? I love my gift. I love it. It's so like, it's so in 
this season I've seen a couple of celebrities with this item and I can't wait to wear mine out one of these days of course and um, yeah I like that it's reversible you can wear it both ways and um, yeah that's it all right I have a package hidden here behind me that I almost forgot to share with you guys so this is a package from Karl Lagerfeld and I think he used to design for Fendi or thereabout. I don't know if it was Fendi, I don't know if I'm correct, correct me if I'm wrong. But this is Karl Lagerfeld, I've seen a lot of his designs and this was gifted to me a few days ago and I want to actually share this with you guys, it came in a box like so. And um, this is a packaging y'all, it has a dust bag with Karl Lagerfeld printed on it and it's just one dust bag and of course the paper bags of course paper is um it has cow printed out there and look at that it has cow lacrofelt all over it so this is the cute sneakers i actually okay this is from farfetch y'all this is from farfetch so yeah if you want to return it you gotta keep this tag on and uh, it's a gift, so of course I'm not returning it. I love, 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 love it. I can't wait to rock this out with an all black feet or a colorful, or maybe a plain color feet. But I really love to rock this with an all black feet or all white, or a little bit of white and black. So it's like this Balenciaga stocking heel, a uh, stocking uh, sneakers. And I think with this one you have to go up in size because this is actually bigger than my usual size. I wear 38, 39, 39 in sneakers, but I think this is 40. So you might want to go up a size in this. It still has this on here. In here, what is this? Okay, since it's a stocking sneakers, I think they stuffed it in with a whole bunch of stuff just to make it look straight and uh, that I love that it has this extra you know um extra sole kind of thingy it's cute i love that it's adjustable you can adjust it to you know to fit your food and it's stockings i love it and uh, yeah i can't wait to rock it out let me show you all the bottom it still has car level field printed all over the bottom like how unique is that i love it yeah, on to the last one, y'all. It is this. I know you guys couldn't wait. I couldn't wait either. So this is, I know you guys saw me when I went to the store sometime a few months ago to get me a purse or to get me a, a luxury item, which was a gift. I actually wanted a, a Bottega. I actually wanted a Bottega purse since I got the Bottega Mules few months ago which I unboxed for you guys so I wanted to get a purse that matches the, the prints on the uh, on the muse so um yeah it was a gift and I changed my mind from getting that which I should have gotten oh maybe which I should have not but I'm still gonna get that this year that should that is actually on my wish list my uh, luxury bucket list this year um yeah so uh I got this instead and guys i know you guys can wait to see what is inside my first ever purchase from this brand this company this brand this is my first ever purchase and it comes in this beautiful box which i love it's so sturdy and uh yeah so first orange box is this orange yeah it's orange so my first orange box and it, i like the way it opens up y'all it opens up like a bible like my perfume from amwatch so it opens up like hi y'all so my camera died so i had to change the battery and um yeah i was talking about this cute box i showed y'all the packaging this is how it comes uh you guys don't know what is inside i guess all right, so this is the receipt, I guess. Yeah, it has a receipt in there, which I'm not uh, gonna show. Okay, it doesn't have my address, so I can actually just show it. Uh, yeah, so there is it. So
So I'm gonna tell y'all the name of this item if I can find it on the receipt, which I guess it should be. Um, so this item was retailed for I think everything is two thousand dollars. So I'm trying to look for the name of the item. All right, so the name of the item I got is called Corset, D E B E E B. I don't know. I didn't choose that name though. But yeah, so that's what that's it. That's what I got. And um, it came in this orange um, receipt envelope. Like so. And um, let's just get into the item, which I'm super excited to share with you guys. If you follow me on Instagram, I know a lot of you have already seen this. So this is what it looks like. The name, and uh, you want to scan it, you can scan it. It's on there. Ooh, this is the item, y'all. It's so pretty. This tassel, um, I think it comes differently. You have to, I think, I don't know. No, 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 no. All right, so it comes with this tassel. I already had it attached to the body of the bag. Um, it's so cute. All right, so I initially wanted getting an Alma BB from Louis Vuitton. Like, that was gonna be my first ever Louis Vuitton purchase. But you know what? When I saw this one, and again, Louis Vuitton went up a price. I'm like, why do I have to get that for $1,500, $1,500 each when I can add money and get this one? So I love this. I opted for this one. It's so classy. It's so cheeky. It's something you can throw on for a night, day out. Oh, it's something you can throw on for a a day out night out club parties you can carry it like a top handle bag or you can swing it along like so oh wait it came with a strap of course i know you'd be wondering it doesn't have a strap so it came with this strap which has a gold hardware of course and it has louis vuitton crested on the straps as well as you guys can tell i don't know if that's gonna focus it's yeah it's on there and uh yeah so already it came the tassel came in this i already took it out and um i've worn the bag out like i already said it so one thing about this bag i'm gonna say it doesn't sit properly on the surface if i have things in this bag and i'm trying to sit it on the table all right so the bag if i'm trying to sit it on a table or a desk it always falls of it once i stuck it up with things i have things inside the bag it always falls that is just what i don't like that is my current about this okay i love the bag i love the shape i love the the print i don't know what this is called if this is a monogram i think this is a monogram yeah i don't know but this is the one that i opted for it still has the bag the tag of waterproof thingy on here so it won't scratch i'm gonna take that out before so i'm gonna sh i'm gonna take that out later so i'm gonna show you guys how this bag open and let me just put on the strap so you guys can see what it is actually giving with the strap i love this you can wear this as crossbody as well which i love rocking because it's small not too small this can fit a lot it can fit a lot you can wear it like so um yeah, you can wear it like so. It's just something you want to throw on. Let me see if I can just show you guys how this is looking. It's so cute. I love it. I would wear it with anything at all. The good thing is this doesn't select. So you can actually wear this out on a date night with the girls, brunch with the girls. like. Well, I can actually rub this with this fit with this jumpsuit. I have one right now and go about my day. And oh, this is just getting on my nerves. All right, so yeah, crossbody is good as a crossbody. All right, now let's get into the bag. Ooh. All right, now let's get into the bag. So it opens up like so which is so cute i love this interior like the interior is red it's cute y'all know of course louis vuitton bags interiors are the classic ones i guess are red but mostly red so yeah so it, it look at the bag the inside is so roomy for a small bag like this the inside is roomy very roomy but i think the price for the price is the price is too 
Yeah, it's surprising for the size, okay, but it's Louis Vuitton. So it has a pocket here where you can put your wallet, your card case, not a, not a big wallet, but your card case, your keys, your IDs, your credit cards, your debit cards, or your lip gloss. You know, it can fit a lot. Like I already said, I've stuffed a lot of things. I've stuffed this, like I've put a lot of things inside this bag. It can contain a lot. Can I love this. Uh, the good thing is I haven't really seen a lot of people with this bag compared to the Alma BB, which I wanted to get in the first place and changed my mind. So if you look at the bag, it has a Louis Vuitton um, written on here. Uh, Louis Vuitton Paris is written on there. And the bag, look at the bag. It's so pretty, y'all. It's so pretty. I couldn't wait to, you know, rock it out. So now that I've shown it to you guys, I can't wait to like rock it out, take pictures with it. All right, y'all, so now that we've gotten to the end of the video, have you guys subscribed yet? If you haven't subscribed to my channel, what are you waiting for, boo? Hit the subscribe button and let's get the numbers up, okay? Because it's 2021. Should you girl some love? Should you girl some love, okay? Okay. <laughs>